are getting creative in the kitchen with the bougie grazer. We are so happy to have Shonda Turner with us this morning to show us how to make a bougie graze board. Yeah, let's do it. This whole charcuterie trend has exploded. It's crazy. It The last two years, I, I had no clue about this trend, but the last two years it has blown up. There's so many different types of uh, graze boards that you can make. Um, and today I brought one of the most popular um, graze boards that I make. Okay, good. So yep. everyone can get in on the action yep. and learn how to do it because some of the fanciest things on here mm -hmm you say are simple to do, so we'll show you how to do that in just a minute. But first of all, where do we start? What do we kind of need basics? So lots of colors. I teach workshops on this all the time, and my go-to is going to be a spicy cheese, a cheddar cheese, and then something soft. So on this board, we have um, brie, we have a little bit of cheddar, we have some gouda. Mm. So a lot of different cheeses just to kind of mix things up and then bring in some colors, some pops of colors, mm -hmm. uh, lots of fruit. And you can also incorporate vegetables. Now, the fancy word for vegetable, a vegetable tray is called crudités. So you could, this could be like mm. a crudité tray. We just like saying the fancy That's word. That's all fancy, you know, a little uh, crudité on your yes. charcuterie, but you said it's really a graze board, which I can spell. So maybe we just go with graze. <laughs> exactly. But to elevate it to a bougie grade board is mm. to, just to, to give it a little more pop. Pop, salami roses, um, different cuts. I think it's really kind of all about the cuts and um, how you put things together. So, for example, you know, uh, some of my, my cheeses are cut in like little triangles. You're just giving it lots of depth and yeah, the exact, like, like yeah, yeah, yeah that perfect. guy right there. Uh -huh. And um, you're making it fun and bite sized and now people um, or your audience or whoever mm -hmm. um, you're serving this to, they get to pick what they want and they can curate all these different flavors. You find Flavor this bombs. even therapeutic. Absolutely, oh yes. Yeah. So um, a couple of years ago, you know, moving here, um, you know, everyone was coming off of, of uh, really a hard Interest, time. Yeah, hard times, and and for me, this was therapeutic. It got me off the couch. I was able to tap into my creativity and really elevate my mood. You know, uh, we all fall into like a little bit of depression, and so for me, mm -hmm. that um, it really helped uh, me tap into uh, a little bit of creativity and. Give me that big smile. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's a good reason to have people over to or mm -hmm. take something over to someone's house that you feel a little, you know, yeah. more proud about Absolutely. than, you know, a bag of chips and salsa, which right. I've been guilty of probably way too many times. Don't ever bring it now. Okay. After we learn the salami rules, you cannot bring anything other than a board, even if you just throw in a salami. I'm gonna make you proud once you teach me. So this looks a little intimidating, Chandra, <laughs> but you say even the, the most beautiful things on the board are easy to make. Yeah, Walk us through it. it. Okay. So we're gonna make uh, a simple salami rose. Now okay. you can do this with um, regular salami. You only need 10 to 12 slices, or you can do this with, um, and I'm gonna steal this one, I'm gonna show okay, you Okay, I'll one. take a little guy. And um, you can either do this with, uh, if you're vegetarian, you can do cucumbers. I've seen people do watermelon radish, which is really pretty. Oh, yeah. So just uh, explore with anything round, but okay. we're gonna use salami today. Okay. We're gonna use about 12 pieces of salami. Okay. So you're gonna take five pieces All right. of salami and you're gonna line this cup, just a little condiment cup or a ketchup cup, anything that you have at home that's kind of, uh, that's this size, so. Okay, I'll just, just line them, all right. Oh, I see what you're doing, okay. Just yep. line them around We're like just that. going around. Easy, okay. Yep. Yeah, Perfect. you got this. Okay, there, I'm And lined. so you got five uh -huh. in there, look at that. Okay. And then we're gonna take three pieces, and I teach these up, teach this technique at my workshop. And then um, we're gonna take three pieces, stack them like this. We're gonna fold them in half. Okay, like a snowman and yes. then fold oh, it. Yeah, you got it. Okay. Like a little taco. And then we're gonna take it from the top and roll it down. All right. Okay. Oh, I see it. I yeah. see it taking shape. Look at that. Yep. Look at that little. It's starting to take shape. And you okay. can even pop a little skewer in here, put a little tomato and okay. um, basil, and you got you could just use this like this. But we're gonna build this a little bit more, so we're gonna take the rest of our pieces fold those in half and just start wrapping them around. Okay, okay, okay. Look at that. All right, I see. I see the vision. Oh, I'm catching right. on to your vision. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh my gosh, it's so simple, but it looks like it would be so intricate. Tell nope. your friends, and then I guess, was working on this all day <laughs> for your party. And this really, really elevates uh, any board. Okay, and so guess where we're gonna put this at? Oh yeah, we're gonna pop it right in the center, huh? Pop it in the center. Okay. There we go. All right, let's do it. In Let's compare roses. Oh, my money's on you, Chandra. Yep. <laughs> Look at, oh my 
goodness. Mine's acceptable. Ah, no, it looks good. Yours is perfection and no. mine's acceptable. No. But look at that. Oh my goodness. But it's a start. It's yes. a start. This is awesome. People can be part of this. It's so much fun to do. It connects people. How can they find you? So I can be found um, uh, all over the internet. Well, my website is the Bougie Grazer. Okay. And my Instagram is of course, at the Bougie Grazer. Uh -huh. Everything is the Bougie Grazer. So yeah, it. just type in Bougie, Bougie Perfect. Grazer, um, and you will find me. I teach workshops, they're always sold out. Um, we'd love to see you. Yeah. And um, I want you all to bring this to, this is what you're bringing to the party. Bring it, we are bring, bringing our Bougie board to the next party, Bougie <laughs> Grazer. Thank you so much. It is so much fun and appreciate oh, all, the, all the tips. I love it. Oh, I love it. <laughs>